Hello Sagittarius viewers. I've been gone for quite a while, but I am back now. So I'm just going to get into it, whatever the cards want to say. And I'm still doing private readings, by the way. So if anyone wants a private reading, my email, even when I'm not on, I'm, I'm still, I always do the private reading. So my email is dragonenchantress at awol.com. That email is right below in the description box. But uh, let's get into it. And, and please engage with the video too if it's resonating with you. If this is your energy group, please like, comment, you know, share it out, subscribe. I'm trying to get back in the algorithm, get YouTube to promote my videos again. So I really appreciate the engagement. So let's see what the reading is about. Let's see what we got here. Official person, sudden wealth, child, gift. Some of you, if, if you're not planning on getting pregnant, you might want to be a little bit careful right now. <laughs> Toil and labor, unexpected income. Yeah, we have unexpected income and sudden wealth both here. So I feel like for some of you, this could be child support or it could be some kind of gift, some kind of financial opportunity. Because it's a really good energy because you have this energy of like somebody who's like working hard, like working like minimum wage or just working all the time, like just feeling like exhausted with work. And then it's like you have unexpected income. So either like a financial blessing or just somebody offering you some financial help. Maybe if you're waiting on a loan, I would say this is a good sign. Message, thoughts, Mature man, mature woman. This could be um, older relatives helping you out because it's like we have like this, this couple here, mature man and mature woman. I feel like you have... You have someone that's older that's thinking about you right now that's maybe worried about you or they're worried about they're not sure if you're doing okay financially because so we have message and thought so it's like this person's like thinking about you someone's thinking about you and they're wanting to reach out mature man mature woman courthouse main male courtship community let's see here I feel like you have a lot of distant horizons, high honor. Let's see here. This isn't for everyone. This is just a message that wanted to come out for a few of you. So I'm going to get into the main reading in just a minute. But to wrap this up, this feels like... I feel like you might get help from unexpected places. So this could be financial help from relatives that you weren't sure if they would help you or like a loan. I also feel like for some of you, this is about some kind of injustice. Could have something to do with like court or like the legal system. Someone that maybe betrayed you. And I feel like, I feel like the cards are telling you to basically speak your truth here because there was... I feel like there was somebody here, maybe someone that you dated or were close to or that wanted to date you that I feel like eventually they're going to have integrity and realize how they wronged you. But I think it's kind of saying it's okay to speak your truth because you might need help from people from the community regarding this. Like this might be someone that you hurt and now they're wanting to spread rumors about you, like a friend or a lover that you had a falling out with or somebody that like was maybe abusive with you and it's like the community is only hearing their side of the story. You know, it's like this person's always the victim and you know, everyone else is is abusing them in, in their, you know, for how they word things. So I, I'm getting the energy here of basically unexpected help, unexpected support, where it's not that people don't support you, it's that people are not hearing your side of the story on something. They, all they have to go off is, is what this person is saying, you know? Like there might be people in the community, it's like they don't know the truth because they're only hearing this person's side of the story. So it might be one of those situations where it's like, it's okay to speak up. It's okay. I mean, be safe. Like if this person is potentially dangerous, of course, protect yourself. But it's one of those situations where you might need to seek legal help or maybe even reach out to this person's family. Like if they're 
blackmailing you or trying to hurt you. I mean, and I can't, you know, I can't give any legal advice, like disclaimer, you know, I'm not responsible for what anyone does or doesn't do as a result of these readings. But, um, you know, use your own discernment here too. But, but yeah, it just, it just feels like, you know, it's reaching out to the community, reaching out to people you might be able to trust, sharing your side of the story, sharing your truth, basically. And maybe going, maybe some of you are like, you know, some of you might be being threatened or being abused by somebody and you're like, well, I don't want to like, you know, tell this person this they're doing. And it, it might be one of those things where you need support. You might need to let people know what's happening. You need to let people know, like, you need to let someone know what's going on. You know what I mean? Like, you need to... You need to let someone know what's going on, basically. Um, you know what? I think I'm actually... Let me... Let me pull some more cards on this. King of Cups. So it could be a water sign too. Someone that was dishonest. There needs to be justice here with the Temperance card. That's about balance. Page of Swords. Four of Wands. Peace. Ten of Cups. It's it's almost like I think you allowed too much because you wanted to keep the peace. Because maybe you wanted to see the good in this person. This could be a situation where there might have been children involved or their family and it's like you just you didn't you didn't want there to be drama and it's kind of saying I feel like the cards are saying like that tower moment came anyway. You know what I mean? Like it was inevitable. So I, I think I think stop basically stop showing stop seeing the good in this person and start seeing what they've shown you and start, you know, defending yourself a little bit more. Yeah, being in that Queen of Swords energy and that Queen of Pentacles, like stable and, and strong and grounded. Um, walking away, Eight of Cups, you know, and getting out of this financial difficulty. Yeah, it's it's almost like you're having difficulties and this person might be threatening you or they're just kind of keeping you tied down and you're afraid of what happens if you leave. And I'm not saying just up and leave if this person's dangerous, but it, it's like, I think it's saying that there are, it's basically saying that there is support around you. There are resources around you and they might be unexpected. It might not be, like I said, it might be alone. It might be this person's, for someone I'm getting, it's this person's family. Like you wouldn't think that you could reach out to their parents and say, hey, your son is, or your daughter is doing this. Like I want you, you know, what do I do? But, but, and, and you know, use your own discernment. But for some, I'm feeling that energy where there's unexpected support. You know, you do have and financial support too, where you, you might be, this might be one of those situations too, where you're wanting to move out. Like maybe you guys live together and you're wanting to get away somehow. And you're like, well, I don't know if my parents would let me move back in, or I don't know if I could go to this shelter or to this place. And it's saying that you actually do have options. There are places that you could go. So, you know, Take that as it resonates. Use your own discernment, but but basically, you know, do what you need to do to carefully, safely get yourself out of this situation. This is probably only for like two or three people. This is really specific. So I'm going to come back with another um, Sagittarius reading, actually, just because, you know, because this isn't going to resonate with most of you. So uh, check back for that if this was not your energy group.